हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज वन ऑफ द क्वेश्चंस बिलोंगिंग टू द सब्जेक्ट ऑफ फ्लूड मैकेनिक्स दैट अपेयर्ड इन द मॉर्निंग सेक्शन सेशन ऑफ गेट एग्जामिनेशन 2018 सो इट अपेयर्ड ऑन 3rd फरवरी 2018 दैट इज टुडे सो द क्वेश्चन इज वेरी सिंपल एक्सट्रीमली सिंपल क्वेश्चन टू आंसर एंड इज रिलेटेड पर्टिकुलरली टू पेल्टन वीनल दैट इज द पेल्टन टर्बाइन सो व्हाट द क्वेश्चन सेज इज द मैक्सिमम वर्क आउटपुट फॉर अ पेल्टन व्हील इज ऑब्टेंड when the ratio of the bucket speed to the jet speed is i think everyone knows what the jet speed is it is the speed of the jet water jet coming out of the nozzle what is the bucket speed it is the linear speed of the buckets uh, the buckets that are fixed to the runner of the turbine okay so what they are asking is that for a given jet speed what should be or basic if the given jet speed is known what should be the bucket speed that is what should be their corresponding ratio so that the work output is maximum and obviously when work output is maximum this means the efficiency should be maximum so when we talk of the jet pelton turbine we know that the power produced in the pelton turbine is m dot v minus u into small u now in this m dot is the mass flow rate mass that is coming out of the nozzle in one second the cap, uh, the small v is the jet, uh, jet speed that is the which is mentioned here small u is the bucket speed which is again mentioned here and uh, when we talk of the efficiency this efficiency is the ratio of the power generated in the turbine to the energy issued by the nozzle now when we talk of energy issued by the nozzle it is half m dot small v square right so when you will put all the quantities this efficiency will become small v minus u into u by small v square i'm sorry there is a mistake here this should be small v right so when we talk of efficiency this efficiency is nothing but it is v u minus u square by v square so if v is a known quantity then eta is a function of u then in order to find out eta what we, eta maximum what we can say is the d eta by d u should be equal to 0 right so when you take a differential of this so differential of this will become v u will become u minus u square it will become 2 u so we will have v minus 2 u by v square this will be the differential of eta with respect to u now for maximum eta this differential that is the slope of eta versus u this has to be zero so it is only possible when v minus 2 u is equal to zero that is small u is equal to v by 2 or u by v is equal to 1 by 2 right so 1 by 2 is the correct answer that is 0.5 so for any query Uh, regarding gate examination gate 2019 and all you can contact on this number which is 08061722666 thank you